Sorry for spoiling your date. It's not a date, is it? Forget gigs. Last Dinosaurs are in the valley right now, mixing their new record. What well, if they don't even let me in? This is my one opportunity at something that doesn't suck. And I'm stuck in a oh. stinking, piss-stained stairwell with you. Some people like it pure and uncomplicated. I don't need the drama. I should have told you, but I... Who gets married? I do. Banana Tropicana! Banana Tropicana! Anyone? After this, we're going to party. We get paid in cash, the money's twice as good, and the outfit's a hundred times better. What's the maths on that? Uh, X over 99% less shameful. Do you know how hard it was for me to be the Sun Visor girl? Oh, boo-hoo. Talking to giant banana guy. <laughs> how do I look? <clears throat> like someone who thinks it's a good idea to wear a bow tie. Hey! Hey. You've got to see this house. I think the word is mansion. Only a complete egomaniac would need to live in something this big. You'd always go back to being Booth Girl. Yeah, and you can always go back to being an annoying douche boy. Guys, can we just do this without all the sarcastic bickering and sexual tension? What? <sighs> Nothing like a naked lady statue to say, welcome to my mansion. There's five bathrooms. Dirty rich people. Why do you need five bathrooms? Someone has to clean all those bathrooms, you know, and I'm guessing it's an underpaid, uneducated woman. Settle down, Jermaine. Rob, this is Tammy and Ed. Hey, sorry about the short notice. The event planner guy had a complete meltdown and walked out with all his staff. But if we can get through this all right, I'm shouting everybody drinks at Duck Duck. Duck Duck? Shut the f- That place is hardest to get into than the valley. Well, a mate of mine works on the bar. I can get you guys in the door easy, but I really need you to pull your weight today. Okay? We'll work like dogs. Or bees. Think of something that works really hard and that'll be us. to Yamcha, but now I'm going to ask you why you were lying to that guy about what happened at the party. I doing a little job to cover my excess. You're always lecturing me about telling the truth, and here you are committing insurance fraud. This is completely different. This is business. It doesn't matter what you call it. A lie is a lie, and you looked pretty good at it. Guess I learnt from the expert. Yeah, which is why I never fall for any of your bullshit. You can't fool me, Scarp. One step ahead. Whatever. Lady, how are you going? Best day of my life. I came to cheer you up with brunch. Never say brunch. I was going to have yum cha with my dad, but then I thought in-store picnic with you would be so much better. Plus, we had a fight. Whatever. Whatever. How are you feeling about Mr... I'm so hot, I forgot to tell you I was married. Like I never want to talk about it again. Oh, I know. Guys are only good for one thing, heavy lifting. There's plenty of them around to get that job done. 
I know I'm not supposed to say this, but I'm kind of creeped out by used clothes. I mean, when they're designer vintage, I can do it, but this is where clothes come to die. It's like a sad fashion graveyard. No, it's where fashion comes to be reborn and recycled. We just got some hilarious 80s stuff in. I'll bring it out. You know, I was thinking about studying visual merchandising and I read all this stuff about how to really maximise the impact of your display. These should be colour coded. This morning, I was banana boy. But now I'm on the door at the coolest club in the valley. Yeah, it's great. Except you don't have an ID and you're grounded. Yeah, I know. I never get into clubs. I need this. Do you remember when the door whore at Dom Pedro's made you dance in front of everyone and then said you weren't good enough to get in? <sighs> Bitch was drunk on power. This is not going to be like all those other times. We're going to figure out a way how to get me ID and then we're going out for the best night of our young lives, little lady. Uh, have you got any ideas? It's not up to me to have ideas. I have dreams. You're always making plans and lists. Make a list of plans to get me some ID. Time. I'm a tiny bit busy with tiny Russian fish eggs. Why don't you call Eva? Genius. OK, people are arriving. Luke, you're on bar. Ed Food. Tammy, do you play cards? Um, yeah, I, I kind of had a bit of an online Texas Hold'em habit slash problem, but I'm good now. How do you feel about Lycra? Yeah, uh, it's probably time and a place for it, like the Winter Olympics. Also right now. Electric. No, you need to get that off and try this. <laughs> sure, if you want people to think you're an accountant, then that's perfect. This suit says Danish rock star on a break from recording an album in Copenhagen. That's good. Yeah. Okay, see this hemline? It adds volume above the knee, which actually draws the attention away from your... Yeah. Issues? <laughs> this is a party? I know. Who died? Old people have strange ways we can't understand. But for the cash that we're making and the massive night that will happen when we spend it, we can pretend like we care. Aren't you grounded? Yeah. My parents are still spazzed that I bailed on my birthday. If they found out what really happened, they would lock me up. Dad, what are you doing here? What are you wearing? Oh, it's a work do. I was thinking Mississippi Riverboat Casino, but everyone else seems to have gone Monte Carlo. Anyway, the general manager, he just got CEO, so he invited us all to share in the fruits of his success. Speaking of fruits, weren't you supposed to...? Y yeah, uh, I finished that and then we got this. Like a drink, Mr Newman? Uh, uh, yeah. Hi. <laughs> you look very James Bond in that outfit. Cheers. He's coming over. Who? Hey. Stacey, the CEO. Isn't Stacey a girl's name? He's talking to the bald man. That guy's your boss. He's way younger than you. Only a year. Hey. <laughs> Congratulations. Thanks, mate. I couldn't think of a better man for the job. Oh, of course, of course. Uh, this is my son, Ed. Well, if anything goes wrong, I know where to come, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Just like your dad. Yeah, we uh, worked together years ago. How's it going down there in mortgages, Pete? Yeah, oh, great. Down in the old dungeon, eh? Eh? Yes. Uh, your place is awesome. Oh, yes, thanks, mate. But, uh, the wife and a headdress actually challenge friends. They are. Uh, design the place. I take care of the artwork. Hey, have a look at this little beauty over here. See this little baby? It's worth $100 for every year since it was made. Mesopotamia. Yeah, I nearly put guacamole in it before. That was a joke. I'm gonna go back to work. <laughs> Eva's not returning my messages. So when he calls Scarlett, she's a frequent phone checker. Yeah, we don't really have a call each other for phone chats and favours kind of relationship yet. So relax and wait for Eva. Hola, Eduardo. Eva says hi. He says you have 16 missed calls. 
He says he can get us into something called Duck Duck tonight, but he needs fake ID. Yes. Say yes. We can do it, but you're gonna have to owe us big time. Love me. So, what's this about ducks? Woo! Going to the nightclub. Gonna get messy. Woo! Something new. <laughs> A problem to two. Fall out of this one group. Something entirely new. <laughs> 